I take off my specs, sit down and collect my thoughts of another day in the past. How it don't last like it used to last. It's commonplace to get your ass splattered from a gun blast. Not trying to preach, just trying to reach out and feel me. I chose the righteous path and now people are out to kill me. Killing myself, advertising suicide, explaining formulas for black on black genocide. In other words, hey yo. So today, about Arm Day, you already know, kicked it off with the preachers just to kind of get a feel for where my arm is at today. I didn't want to take it too hard. I wanted to try to take it light. This whole workout moved into tricep extensions. I was really focusing on that squeeze. These felt amazing. It's not very much issues when it comes to my tricep it's just in my bicep when i go to pool that's where i'm still having a lot of issues you already know so only superset my hurt arm so i did kickbacks with the hurt arm light very controlled burnt it up the key to these is just to make sure you get your arm in a full range of motion and squeeze as hard as you possibly can so moved in from that to seated curls with a little twist for the forearm y'all know how i feel about my seated curls i only do seated curls because it makes you stronger faster none of the swinging none of the jerking you can't cheat you just gotta let your biceps do the work and then i superset that with the band you already know I'm going in today. Let's go. Not gonna lie, I was a little disappointed in myself. I could barely still get three reps. And that's disheartening, man. That squeeze is very hard. We're gonna get back to normal though. We getting there. So moved into tranquils. And I already told y'all, bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep. That is how you do an arm day. Do not defer from that tranquils down and out the best tricep movement you can get there is none better and yes i create this not being biased but i am the best and i say i'm the best because i have mastered my body you know what i'm saying you cannot call yourself the best if you have not mastered your own body and I do not believe you can be the best if you take steroids, period, point blank. You cheated. I don't care what nobody got to say. If you mad, slap yourself. You steroid heads cannot be the best, period. So for the finisher, I wanted to try something a little different today. I haven't done these in a while, so I did. Skull crushers, slow and controlled because they don't, they're not the greatest movement. I don't know why I chose these. I think I just wanted to try them because I haven't tried them. And they wasn't the greatest, but when I get something in my mind and I tell myself, this is going to be my finisher, that's what I do. So I think I got about four sets back and forth from the skull crushers to seated curls with a five, I think, oh no, maybe a 10 pound plate. So I just did that back and forth, back and forth till my arms gave out. Always throw in a finisher at the end of your workouts. Don't be a slacker. You just got to make sure you leave it all in the gym. That is the number one rule. But that's pretty much all I did on today. Y'all remember, until next time, stay natty, my friends. We're watching a master at work. Yeah. We're watching a master at work. Yeah.